Thanks for tuning in to this spooky edition of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. I'll unlock the mysteries of the mansions and catch those ghouls with your help. Thanks for tuning in, and have a safe and happy Halloween. Time to deal with some uh, visual tricks and tomfoolery. Criminy? That's, that's just an old word. Someone's been casting illusions in the gloomy manner. Well, I guess it's my time to shine. And I've got something to show you. What's this? Why doesn't he... Why doesn't anyone speak? You know what I mean? He's like... It's just a weird thing. All right, so cool. Uh, that gloomy spirit, I believe, is something we can get inside the manor from what he said right there. I know how to read occasionally. Uh, my name is uh, Mr. Reedy O'Brien, the number one reader across the internet. And uh, there's something involving the, the mansion, the thing. Are we good? But now that you're here, you can get in there and grab it. Cool. All right, so we got to go back to that room over there. And the digitization sequence begins, etc. I'm just a bunch of floating pixels through space, which technically, uh, you watching this video right now, I am a floating bunch of pixels uh, floating through space. So you know what? That's a uh, fair game as well. Cool. So we got to find the dark light device. Uh, that kind of rhymes a little bit. And these guys still trying here. Not going to work as long as you keep running. And the base keeps running, running, and running, running. You're good. You don't need to deal with that. Uh, couldn't find the puppy from before. I thought we would have found him by now, but clearly no. And you're gonna... Oh, okay. That's a bit much. And that's the sound of boo. So nothing we can do about that. Cool. Uh, is there anything in here that I need to know about? Maybe. Let's investigate just for the sake of investigating here. Or rather, let's go through uh, this door, or rather this uh, lookout point right here. Is there anyone home? Oh, n no. There's someone in the chair there, clearly, but okay. What is our mission here? Find the dark light device. Okay, cool. So, we'll see. There's no way for me to look through here, right? Oh, there is. Not. Okay, cool. There is not. Nice. Hmm. Do I go... There's a... Oh, cool. Well, he prompts you what to do. So this is a welcome call from Egad. I'm like, do I go through the fireplace or what? That's been haunted from the spirit balls. I'm sure there's another way into that room. Well, you had the right idea, man. All right, so let's go through the top down. Maybe that's uh, a clue as to how to get from point A to point B here. Are you going to trick me again? No, you're... Yep, yeah, you are. Cool. For some reason, I just knew. I just knew that, like, maybe... They were going to do something. Oh, hello. Pinhead. Who are you calling Pinhead? <laughs> Whatever. All right. Can I activate this? That's not something I can do right now. Nope. Okay, cool. Uh, let's do this. And you get over here. Now, these ones are no match. They used to be the big baddies for a hot minute here, but yeah, not anymore. They are totally good. Now, these pinhead things, they're lurking around everywhere here, it seems. So, get them out of here. And they're good. There's more. Get. Go. You can also see him in the reflection uh, in the aquarium, too, so that's good. Ah, no. Cool. Do that. Flash it immedi immediately. Flash. There we go. Cool. You can kind of nab them as soon as they appear out of something. That seems to be the, uh, the go-to way to take care of them. So uh, make sure you don't hesitate. Is that? It looks like that cheap, cheap-looking thing down there, like, has a teardrop coming out of them. But, like, it's just his broken face, which is kind of creepier. So I don't know why they decided to do that. But, okay. Maybe just to add the spookiness to it. It might have something to do with it. So, uh, is there any way to get through via the parlor? Yes, there is. Cool. Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's in the clock. Cool. Nice. So, through here. We can just enter just like Santa Claus. <laughs> Luigi is Santa Claus confirmed. Uh, that's the secret your parents don't want to tell you, kids. Is uh, Santa Claus is actually uh, not real. And it's Luigi who comes down your chimney every Christmas Eve. That is true. I can confirm. Uh, tell 
Go run up to your parents and say, uh, Mom, Dad, I know that Santa Claus isn't real. It's Luigi. Luigi's the one who brings me gifts on Christmas. And they will be like, you know what? You, you, we've lied to you this whole time. You're right. It is. It is Luigi. That's what it is. Oh, you got shades on, buddy. Okay. And, oh, that didn't... Oh, come on. There we go. Nice. Yeah, there it is. All right, so you just got to inhale the shades there. That'll take care of it. Is there anything else? Yeah, there are. Cool. Get him out of here. There we go. And got the Tufa, the two-time. There we go. Give me them bars. And this is the, uh, the, the a thing I thought was an upgrade, but it's a new ability that you get in the game. Uh, this allows you to uh, see those invisible items there. So that's a, a cool little thing here. So it's like a, a rainbow light, a UV light, whatever you want to call it, the dark light device. And now EGAD is going to be the most obnoxious tutorial. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Brian Saviano, a.k.a. Bricks O'Brien. I'm going to show you how to use the dark white device. Press it out with the Y button. That's how you're going to... Uh, ooh, ooh, you can only use a certain amount of it there. Interesting. All right. Oh, it recharges, though, so that's good. All right, so we can investigate things over here. Oh, there's a, a thing here. There we go. Cool. Now I can inhale more of that here. What does that do? Is that what we need to it get? It seems like it. Oh, cool. So we need to inhale those, which will make whatever we want to see be seen. I get you. Okay, so now for those other sections, we can go all the way back and do the whole... Ah, uh, I know what to do. So do this. There we go. Now inhale all these. That'll make it appear. Cool. Very nice indeed. Now we're starting to get the gravy train rolling here. So, uh, and, you know, Lu <laughs> Luigi going down the... <laughs> <Yellow>. <laughs> Imagine how disappointing that would be if, like, Christmas Eve, you hear, like, a doo -doo 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 -doo, and you're like, what is that? And you, you rush downstairs at, like, 2 o'clock in the morning, and you just see Luigi <laughs> standing in your living room being like, oh, yeah, I'm going to leave you the good gifts, Okay. Mom, you know, like that whole thing, <laughs> that'd be, that'd be amazing. That would be fantastic. I hope that doesn't happen for your sake, because I'd be very disappointed if I were you. But you know what? Hey, that's fine. All right, and there's another door over here, of which we can access, maybe. I don't know. Yes, we can. Cool. And obviously, we know that. Cool. And that is a patio. Cool. Okay, so nothing over here. Nothing, obviously, on the chair, as you maybe think. Okay, anything in the wind chimes? No. There's bats. Give me the bats. There we go. Anything over here? Oh, yeah. That seems kind of terrifying. Both this merry-go-round thing and the flash of lightning. That would be no bueno. And there's another door. Cool. This is very nice. I like this ability here. You can just find all sorts of cool stuff everywhere, it seems. Is that a crow? A raven? A whatever? Uh, wait, wait. There we go. That turns into money. Uh, anything that you see that's gold turns into money. As so I've been told. Oh, that's the thing right here. See it? It looks like a thing. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's a statue of Egad. How egotistical is that? Look at that. Hey, buddy. Can you give me a reward or something? No? I'll spin your parasol. Are you going to fly away into the night sky? Yeah, you are. Kind of. You're going to give me a thing, aren't you? Yeah, that's a key. Cool. Nice. It'd be cool if there were, like, a ton of random keys that you would need. This is probably needed for the door right here, right? No, it's not. Okay, cool. That works. Up. Uh, there we go. And up. Flash. Up. Flash. Or do this, rather. Come on. There we go. Got all the uh, things here. Sweet. And if we're here, we're good. Oh, that's what I want. That thing right there. Cool. So basically, that was a very elaborate way to uh, get that all taken care of there. All right. So I guess I'll... Where do we even need to go? What is, what is my mission? What is this? It's a gem? 
I think that's a gem, actually. No, it's just the globe? What does that matter? Uh, burn it with fire? Set the world- Yeah, set the world on fire! Get it? That's the joke! You gotta set the world on fire! Ha! That's pretty cool. Can I climb up this? Of course not. That would make things easier. Alright, cool. Ooh, so the dumb waiter is where we needed to go, and now- Ooh, it's a boo! Hi, boo! You're gonna- Oh, you are the one causing the- The spirits here. Okay, so you are the problem. I need to take care of you. Or you're just gonna go away. Okay, nice. So let me revive the table here. Cool. And take all these. Thank you. Okay, so they kinda teleport everywhere, it seems. So that's decent. Oh, okay. Now, do they... Oh, they all respawn, so they need to be all uh, acquired within a certain time frame here. Okay. There's one. Now, here we go. Nice. There it is. Okay. So that worked out. Oh, you're back. Yeah, that's right. Everything you did was for nothing. It was worthless. Yeah, that's right. What you gonna do about it, huh? Do I need to use a UV light to actually find you? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. We'll try that first. Oh, yeah? Or maybe uh, that's the first step here to finding you is getting rid of all those. That's a dog bone? What is that? That's kind of weird, but okay. Can you tell me what that's for? <laughs> it's probably for the puppy. Uh, you seem to have found something special there. I've heard your chances of finding one of those is better if you have a lot of treasure. I get the feeling that bone will come in handy when you need it most. But that's just a wild guess. Yes, pure speculation. Okay, so this man has no idea what's actually happening here. But, you know what? That's fine. That's, uh, you know, pretty easy to come by here. And can I just... How do I... How do I destroy him? Is it through this? Yeah. Do I do this? What do I do? Yeah. Oh, you have to get him by the tongue? That's kind of weird. Now I'll grab you here. Is that it? Yeah, it is. Cool. <laughs> it's a cool little animation there. So that's it, right? Because that's the whole mission, I think. Right? Is that it? Uh, it looks like it. Maybe. That, I mean, that that's the whole... That's what Egan wanted out of us, so that, that would make sense, right? You okay, Luigi? I'm fa I'm fantastic, actually. Uh, get you out of there. Okay, so yeah, that is it there. So there's just uh, one more mission, it seems like, in the uh, A mansion here. So we'll see how well uh, this one goes. And I got that dog bone, which I don't know what the dog bone will do, but cool. And that is a silver rank still. So we've gotten almost half of the gems for the entirety of the uh, area here. So that's cool. Looks like we have uh, a little bit more to go. So that's good. I guess it's good, right? It, it, it still hasn't hit for the, the spooky seat. Well, I mean, it's kind of hit. I need to go out and buy a Halloween costume. I'm not actually doing anything on Halloween. Other than probably playing Luigi's Mansion 3. Uh, me and my friends have not come up with any uh, Halloween spooky related plans. So, this seems to be the first of my uh, Halloween excursions and whatnot. Uh, no Halloween parties to uh, go to or anything like that. So that's fine. That's the Scare Scraper. I think that's a multiplayer mode that I will not play because I don't have any friends to actually play with me. Multiple 3DSs and all that, so... Uh, Cool. Uh, hold on. The periscope is acting up. Interesting. Okay. So, I will go back here. And, uh, visual tricks is done. With the two star. And the boo! So maybe there's a boo in every single level here. We'll try out the sticky situation here. Something about... Oh, is it... Is that... Does that involve Guigi? Is Guigi in this game? I don't think so. Uh, Guigi is definitely in the next game. He's in three, and he makes an appearance in one. Because it, like, it's just a new thing that happens, so I don't know. Whatever. Cool. Alright, so we gotta go 
All right, we gotta clean up all the webs. Interesting. Okay. Clean the webs. There's one. They're kind of scattered everywhere, it seems. All right. Oh, there's spiders everywhere. It's almost like that might be the, uh, the boss of the area here, maybe. Oh, that one I do know. Th that is the boss, just so you know. It is all spider related. Oh, and it's basically just cleaning up. We're literally cleaning up all the spider webs. Okay. Not a very uh, enticing mission, I guess. We're just revisiting all the rooms here. So maybe that's a, a reoccurring trend, you know? Maybe for like the fifth mission in every level, it's just gonna be me tearing off clothes on the in the bureaus here, it seems like. We'll do this, there we go. There's one more, where is there one more? Is it in here? No. Because every room says it's clear when it's done. Oh, is it in here? Is that the thing? Yeah, it is. Cool. All right. Thought maybe it might have been. All right. Might as well take off the carpet. Oh, cool. That's a heart. So in case you need it, that's good. Uh, is there one up here? Oh, yeah. There we go. I'm almost tempted to, like, fast forward through it, but, like, no, nah, that's kind of cheap. You know, I won't do that. Uh, I'm I'm very tempted to, because basically now we're being as if we were actual like, you know, vacuum cleaners, just going from room to room cleaning the rest of the mansion here. So, I don't know if this place is haunted still. Oh, that's a big, that's a big one. That's a big boy there. Okay, and can I launch it or like something? I don't know what to do. Okay, so we can we can exhale using L. Gotcha. Okay, so nothing I can do about this right now. Uh, maybe I could set this on fire. Is is that a thing? Can I set this on fire? No. Yeah, I can. Look at that. Wow. Look how smart I am, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Even though I had played this section before. I didn't quite realize that's what I could do. So that's uh, very effective there, nice. I can eliminate all these spider webs here. Access all the areas, cool. All right, and so that's it there. Uh, that thing technically does slash doesn't count. The library here, it's all cleared out. So yeah, then if I had skipped all that, that would have been uh, not cool of me to not show that, you know? Show the little secrets on how to Clear everything out here, you know. All right, so that's 17. There's some on the second floor there, but technically for the first floor, we're good. Uh, can I? I can get up through this way, right? I always forget. Yeah, the dumb waiter over here. Cool. So I'll go up to the second floor and just clear everything out. So yeah, I actually uh, challenged uh, Ricky because there was a. Uh, I was gonna record Luigi's Mansion 3 videos all day. And he was like, oh, that's kind of sad that you'd rather, like, record videos instead of hanging out with us on Halloween. And my, my argument was that we never do anything interesting on Halloween anyways, so why not, you know, do what I want to do and, like, you know, record videos and do all that. So, uh, is this actually doing anything? Is this doing anything? Is this actually? No, it's not doing anything. Okay, cool. 